Melfab is proud to introduce this international tanker that is built for the Marguerite, Nova Scotia Fire Department. It is built on a 2010 international cab that has seating for three firefighters. It has a uh, 330 horsepower engine, a 3000 Allison EVS transmission. The uh, seating has the seat belt monitoring system and a vehicle data recorder. Uh, it has aluminum wheels, a Kusmal battery conditioner mounted in the chassis step, along with the built-in air compressor. The pump is a 420 PTO pump, and the water capacity is 1500 imperial gallons. At the top of the pump house, there is a uh, monitor connection. There is uh, two cross lays with an adjustable hose bed divider and a deck plate uh, cover with end tarps. At the top uh, left portion of the uh, pump house, there is a uh, hail foam logic foam system with a foam uh, level gauge. There is a pump intake and pump discharge gauge. Uh, there is a uh, water level gauge. There is a uh, heater inside the pump house and the switch is mounted at the top portion. The top portion of the pump panel opens for access to the inside of the pump house. In the middle portion, there are the uh, controls for each discharge with the associated uh, pressure gauge. There is a class 1 total pressure governor mounted on the left hand side. And on the right hand side, there is the uh, control for the primer. The suction is a uh, 4 inch non-gated intake and there is a, a 2 and a half inch gated intake. At the bottom of the uh, pump house, there is the uh, drains, a non-slip uh, step and underneath the pump house there is a heat pan. On the left side of the body there are two compartments ahead of the rear wheel. Uh, they are uh, covered with AM door roll up doors. They are vented and lighted by LED compartment lights. On the uh, upper portion there is a porter tank rack with the deck plate on the uh, body for uh, to protect the paint. In the rear wheel well, there is a uh, federal LED flasher, and at the top portion, there is a uh, beacon and a, uh, a floodlight. At the top of the body, there is a hose bed with uh, two adjustable uh, dividers. There is a hose bed tarp uh, to uh, protect the hoses. On the uh, top portion, there are two inch and a half discharges that are plumb for foam. There are folding steps on each outer edge to gain access to the hose bed. There is a 4 inch direct tank fill that is gated. There is a 10 inch Newton dump with a rotating dump valve that extends to either side that is electronically controlled. Uh, underneath the T of the tank there is storage for uh, two 10 foot lengths of suction hoses. At the bottom portion there is a 19 inch deep step that is non-slip to meet ULC. On the right side pump house there is a door to gain access to the uh, pump compartment. On the inside of the door there is a tank for the RV antifreeze to lubricate the uh, primer. Uh, at the bottom portion there is a uh, 4 inch non-gated inlet, a 2.5 inch gated inlet and a 2.5 inch uh, discharge. At the bottom there are the drains and a non-slip step. Underneath the step area there is a side suction relief valve uh, mounted underneath. The body has a uh, ladder rack that will carry a 2 section 24 foot ladder and a 14 foot roof. There are two compartments ahead of the rear wheels and an LED flasher in the rear fender well.